channel. In today's video, I'm gonna do a little vlog. I'm not gonna vlog my day. I was planning on doing, but I'm kind of like short for time. And also I've got quite a few things to show you in this vlog. So I thought that I would just do that in this video and that's what the video is gonna be. So I'll sit you down and I'm gonna show you a few things that I've bought recently and a little kind of like try on of some of those things. I feel like I'm filming a sit down video. This is just part of the vlog, but I thought I would start off by sharing you a few things that I got from everything5pounds.com. I will show you the item and then I'll show you what it looks like tried on and i've literally only got like two or three things like not much so i thought i would just include it in this little video if you didn't already know everything five pounds.com is basically a website that sells everything for five pounds and that's because they use like old stock from places like i don't know like top shop or somewhere like that or h&m and um, like out of fashion out of trend pieces that would you know not be able to be sold from the store anymore so they will then resell it on for five pounds and i just went on there had a little look around i thought you know i'm interested in potentially getting a few bits i was looking on the website and i was like there's not a whole load on here that kind of like matches my style which is probably what a lot of people will find but who knows and i found a couple of jumpers and also a jewelry item so first of all i will show you the jewelry piece i picked up this this is a snake like necklace but it's like a thick necklace i just wanted something that was like i don't know just cool i just saw this and i thought i like that like it's not everyone's cup of tea it's a snake for starters and the, the the style of it maybe people won't like but i like it so i'll try and put it on now and then you can like see but obviously i'm wearing a turtleneck so it's probably not the greatest item of clothing to be wearing whilst um i'm trying on jewelry like this um because this really it needs to be on like an item of clothing that is not a turtleneck but yeah this is what it looks like and I, I like the fact that you know it can fit anybody's kind of neck really because you can just easily like pop it on and it, I like it it looks cool it's like little snake's head goes all the way around and here's his little tail I just like that and it's just like the kind of thing that I'm like and my style at the minute so I picked that up five pounds I wouldn't say that's like a bargain for a cheap piece of jewelry but I just like it how it is and this is the snake necklace like paired with this jumper um, which I think looks a lot better than with the other jumper that I was wearing and yeah I really like this it's kind of like not a choker but it's more like like it's not a long piece and yeah I really like this it's it's nice um so yeah next thing we got from everything5pounds.com was this um it's hard to show but I will show you a try and clip I might zoom you out because I've got you zoomed in now you can see all the mess on the bed and um, this is what the jumper looks like so it's got a flamingo on the front and I don't really have any you know obsession with flamingos or anything like that or you know animals in general but I liked the colours of this like I like the pink with the blue against the black I just liked kind of the style of this and I still, even after wearing this many, many times since I bought these pieces a couple of weeks ago, maybe three weeks ago, I've been wearing this jumper a lot. This is definitely my favorite thing that I got from everything5pounds.com. Only five pounds, what a bargain. And they have more on there, I think still. Um, might have sold out since I got this, but they did have more on there when I was purchasing this. And it's nice and fluffy on the inside, which is nice. I was shocked at the quality of the material. I was almost expecting this to be a little bit of a really kind of thin material, but actually it's, it's quite nice and good quality. And not, I wouldn't say it's thick, but I wouldn't say it's thin. Like it's nice. I like this and I'm very happy with this. So I'll show you a little clip of me trying it on now. Okay, so this is the jumper. I'm sorry, my mirror does not look so great. Um, but this is what the jumper looks like. I got this in a size large because I like it to be oversized. And yeah, I just like how it fits and like the length of it. And that's what it looks like from the side. And yeah, I really like this and it's really comfortable. And yeah, it's one of my like new favorite pieces in my wardrobe. And yeah, love the colors and it's a complete winner really like this so yeah nice and soft super comfy great quality and i like the look of it so couldn't be happier with this item then the second jumper that i picked up um is actually i had to retrieve this from the wash so apologies for that but this is it there was actually two different kind of color combinations i could have got of this like little jumper kind of thing and it was i think blue and yellow or like this 
colour combination and I wasn't really keen on the blue and yellow one I just wanted a couple like more like jumpers that I could just wear and be casual because I really love casual clothing and this is that kind of vibe so I picked this up again only five pounds and I didn't actually know what it said on here until I got it home so I'm the kind of person like maybe I should you know I've read that just in case it said something really offensive I don't know um but it says make me happy please and I think that's an acceptable statement so we're all good with that um but yeah this is what it looks like on the front and then it looks like that on the back. I probably would have preferred it if it didn't have this strip down the back, but that doesn't bother me. It's not an issue. Um, but yeah, I like this and I got both of them. I think I got this one in the size large. Yeah, I got both of these jumpers in the size large because I wanted them to be oversized because I like oversized clothing when it comes to like loungewear and things like that. Just because I like to feel kind of like comfy and cozy and I just, I just like the fit of them. Um, I'm usually like a small, so, just to bear that in mind if you wanted to know about sizing and things like that but yeah i got large in both of those and i will now show a little clip of me trying that on okay so this is the other jumper it is quite large and quite big maybe i could have got away with a medium but i actually don't think they had a medium um in stock so i thought between a small and a large i'm gonna go for a large it's really nice and cozy and I, I feel so comfortable when I wear this. I actually do really like it. I also really like um, the lettering along here. And yeah, this is just like one of those jumpers where you can just chill in the day and be at home. I could just edit a video and just be really comfy. So yeah, I really like this. And again, it's like the other one, soft in the inside of it and it feels a really great quality. It's a thick material. It's not thin in any way. So I, you know, if they've still got this available on anything5pounds.com or everything5pounds.com, I can't remember what it's called um then go and check this out because it's really nice so that's everything i picked up from everything five pounds.com i would actually recommend having a little look on there the delivery was not expensive it came after about a week so it's not like amazingly quick but then again it's not slow either so yeah i was really impressed with everything that i picked up i think my favorite item is the um black jumper with the flamingo on it i just love the colors of that and yeah very very happy with that um so yeah hi it's me again um i also just thought i'd show you a few bits from i think it's called i think her etsy is called love lucy crafts or something like that i will link her instagram in the description anyway she's somebody i know from youtube back like years ago and i stayed following her on instagram and then she created a small business and i literally love her stuff like the style of everything and all that kind of thing like i just like the vibe of everything that she does so i have picked up quite a lot of stuff i am very much a fan of her things i just take this off because um it doesn't really go with this jumper um but yeah like i was saying i'm a massive fan of her things and the vibe and the style of everything it's just like my cup of tea 100 so i picked up quite a few things from her i have shown a few bits and bobs like on my channel in the past of things that i've purchased from her but i have purchased a few more like newer bits so i thought i would just show everything anyway and also we're here to support small businesses i have my own small business i know what it's like and i i appreciate every single bit of support that i get from anyone so go and check her out she has extremely decent prices literally she could price things so much more i think so um go over to her instagram if you want to go and give her a follow or check any of the stuff out i also kept the boxes of things that she puts them in um i'm, I'm gonna throw them out don't worry i'm not like that weird but I just wanted to show you how it comes so it's a little box and then inside there's like her little sticker there like I look at things like this like when it comes to like little stickers and things like I like that I feel bad throwing stuff like that out um, and then the little thank you for ordering card with one of these like little I don't know what is that called like a little pin thingy on I'm keeping that I will keep that and um, pop it on something and then obviously the receipt for the order and then it's all wrapped up so nice and then with tissue paper that's got her little logo on it and then you open it up and then the item is inside there with bubble wrap in so it's just the thought of everything and I think the reason why I purchased from her like time and time again is because a she's really quick at posting the item it will arrive after a few days and b everything comes packaged really nicely and there's just a cute little things and then I like I like these little cards so yeah I have got a few of these now I've got this one this one and oh my god i have actually got a load 
and this one and this one I chuck all these boxes out and um, so yeah i've got these four just as we're sat here i do actually have more or i think i did have a couple more or another one or something and i'm not entirely sure where that is um but yeah these are these ones and they're all different and i just think that's such a nice like added extra like little touch to things i like these and i'm gonna pop them onto something when i can figure out what to do and now i'm gonna show you some of the things that i've got i'm gonna show you everything that i've got i did actually buy my mum um, for Mother's Day as part of her like little present because I got her like little bits and bobs I got her a little kind of house with the name of the bungalow that she lives in and I thought that was cute so yeah that's what I got her as part of her Mother's Day present um, but I can't show that now because she's got it one of the, fir the first thing that I picked up from her which was just before Christmas was this and I did actually show it in a video and it's like a little kind of love hearty type thing it won't focus on it because it's the camera's focused on my face thank you very much um and yeah I picked this up I just love how this look and like the marble effect of it and it I put it on the Christmas tree to start off with because it's like a little Christmas decoration um but yeah I, I am gonna hang this up on my wall whenever I can get like a little thing to hang it on and I'm gonna have like in one of my rooms like my living room or in my bedroom or something I'm gonna have like little matching things like this just on the side so that's the first thing that I've got before Christmas which I did actually show you the second thing that I ever got from her which I think is the next one was like a little home and you can have like a little house number on or just you could just put any number on like it just could be like your favorite number like it doesn't have to be your house number or anything like that and it's just like a cute little home and i really like this i think this is really nice and it looks good and it's nice quality as well and yeah this is perfect gift idea i don't think she's got them on her etsy anymore which is kind of sad because this is my favorite thing but i love this and um yeah i would recommend but obviously she's taken it down so that's sad but she's got other things on there anyway and this is the thing that i got my mum with the name of her bungalow written on it so yeah love that i keep that actually sat on the side in my kitchen until i can hang that up as well then the next thing that i got which i haven't shown you is this little key ring so this is like a little home key ring she came out with like a little home sort of range and this was part of that as well as the thing i've just shown you and i love this this is so nice quality like it's cute and it's small and the marble effect i really like and i just really like this i think it's really cute and you can just pop it on anything so yeah love this and would recommend getting one of these and i just keep it on my keys i think it looks really nice on your keys and then the next thing that i picked up was this little g here it is um she does different letters now i did have which is not her fault um a slight problem i accidentally snapped this which is my fault um i did message her about it because it was only two days after i bought it but it wasn't her fault i just thought i'd stress that but she did send me another one so i did super glue this back together this is still on my keys i thought i'm gonna keep using this i'm not gonna chuck it out or anything um but she did send me another one um in replacement her customer service is amazing i thought i would just point that out and uh, the other one's on my back and i think this looks great like look how cute that looks so this is the one that she sent me um which is a bit thicker just in case it did break but yeah i really love it on my bag and yeah it's much safer on here than in my keys i think i was just a little bit clumsy that day but uh, it's all sorted now so yeah and then finally from her i have these this is a coaster and this is one of my favorite things that she sells i think she does still sell these and they're really great quality and they just look so nice and yeah i picked one of these up because i was like i i'm always sat there like at my desk and i'd never have like a coaster to put my drinks on i have co coasters but i just wanted one of these because they just look so nice so yeah i would recommend these and i might get some more in the future so yeah love this and the shape and everything like that and the mark Marble effect is really nice so yeah that's the bits that i have from her please go and check her out always support small businesses because it's somebody's hobby and it's also somebody's like way of making money and all the time and effort that goes into it so please go and check her instagram out i will link it in the description um so yeah okay that's my little kind of haul section of this video done um there is actually another video going up very shortly of a haul of some makeup items that i've bought um but that will be in a week or two currently edited currently saving a video it's my body shop video that should have gone up on wednesday so go and check that out if you haven't already showing a few bits that i got from the body shop i feel like it's just hauls 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 recently um but yeah just packing a few things away from showing you that 
and I'm going to show you Stanley's cage. So last time you saw his cage, by the way that's my hamster if you was wondering, um, last time you saw his cage it had like a cardboard cover over the top as a temporary lid instead of like the lid that he's now got which my dad made for him if you don't already know he did live in like a bit of a smaller cage like the kind of hamster cage that you'll get from the pet shop and i just wanted him to have a bigger cage more space to roam around more sawdust can go in and like little things that he can play on and stuff and climb well i'm gonna show you his cage like updated so this is what his cage looks like. My dad made the frame and the mesh and everything like that. So he now can't escape and it's a nice sturdy, good quality lid and you can see right through and yeah, I love it. Um, so I'll just give you like an updated little tour of his cage. Over here is like his little kind of like burrowing section which he doesn't tend to like burrowing that much but he does occasionally so he will just like bury himself in there but that's only occasionally then i've got this which i made myself um which i like to call the chapel for some reason i have no idea why and he climbs on top of that um and does like little pull-ups there um then his little wheel which he's obsessed with he's actually on that 24 7 when he's awake which is not 24 7 then his little food bowl there's a little bit of cheese in there because i cleaned him out today and on clean out day i always give him some cheese um his water bottle stuck on with some sellotape i need to sort something for that but it's, it's fine it's doing good it never falls off um that's his home he's currently in there asleep right now and yeah it says stanley on it because that's his name a little water bowl i actually put that in there just in case his water ever does fall and then he's got some water a little chew carrot that's not a real carrot it's like a chew toy a little toilet roll thingy and then we've got a little seesaw he loves that i put treats and hide them around his cage um a different place in the cage every single day so that i know which things he uses so sometimes i put a treat in there um so yeah he loves his seesaw and then here we've got a little climbing frame um and he likes to go on there and he used to do pull-ups on here um but we've moved that a little bit and my dad's just made him this ladder so he can climb up the ladder and chew it or whatever and get to the top and um, don't worry he can't escape but yeah it that's his updated cage so um if you're a hamster expert or think you are or whatever um don't come at me and say he hasn't got enough sawdust because like he doesn't he's not a hamster that's bothered by that like i've had more sawdust in before and he's just not as bothered about it and he goes to the areas where there's less sawdust he's a happy hamster that's all that matters so please just bear that in mind before anyone comments because they like to for some reason um but yeah so just to round up this video i thought that i would just quickly mention that next week on my fresh faced skincare business type thing um there is gonna be a new product i am releasing a new product next week if i don't do it next week it'll be shortly after it's it's a process you know trying to do new products and stuff it's actually a makeup product. It's something I've not done before. So I will do a video discussing the product and everything like that, trying it on and sharing it with you. But I thought I'd just let you know, if you don't already follow me on my Instagram and my Facebook page for my little skincare business, then please do. They're linked in the description and get ready for like the product and information about it will be over there. So please go and do that. I appreciate all the support. And also my Etsy and my eBay is linked if you would like any of my current products, which are skincare products rather than makeup. But I am like branching into some new things. Um, I've brought out a new product every single um, month so far this year. And I'm not gonna do, and I'm not gonna do that every single month throughout the year. Um, I think after this product, I'm just gonna settle down now and, you know, just, you know, cut back a little. Um, but I, I just had ideas, so yeah. Um, I would like it if you would go and check out my social medias ready for that, which should be next week. So yeah, um, and I think that's everything. So this isn't really like a vlog because I've only been videoing for like half an hour. Um, but I've just been showing you bits and bobs and I just thought that this video would just be nice and casual. So yeah that's everything for this video i hope you enjoyed seeing the things that i got from everything five pounds.com and also from lucy who i get my little bits and bobs from and um stanley's new cage and yeah so uh, thank you for watching and i will see you in my next video goodbye